Hello there and welcome to Complete Games with me James. Hope you guys are all doing well and we're back with a channel update for the month of May 2020. I'll start by having a look back at the previous month of April, going over some of the stuff that's happened and then we'll have a look about what we're going to be doing in the future. So starting off, we're going to go over the analytics and you guys smashed it. We did over 142,000 views across all videos, over 3,000 likes, 270 dislikes, 215 comments and 915 subscribers. So growth wise, the month of April has been the best yet. And I'd just like to say thank you to everybody and welcome to all the new subscribers. And moving on to my Discord. If you'd like to join the Discord, links are in the channel banner. And we have added Ragnarok. We did this because basically everybody's locked down. Some of you didn't have the Genesis map and it's opened it up so anybody who has the original game and is on PC you now can come and join the community server. I've also been busy, I made a channel trailer video as a welcome to the complete games as the one I did previously was literally my first upload. I've also updated my Twitch page and given that a a bit of love and put um, a channel video on there as well so I've been off a couple of days working on those um, I've also made a Twitter account as well so if you want to follow me all of this stuff is in the links to my banner at the top here I know I've used Twitter in the past and it quite often feels like especially when streaming or gaming it's all about pushing promotion and I, I haven't done that at all that's why I'm talking about all of this in my updates. I don't have, I've, I've never shared one of my videos across any social media and uh, I've not used it. I didn't even tell my, my friends and family I was really doing this for quite a bit. Um, they've all cottoned on now and I'm supposed to be doing this stuff. So I'm going to give it a try with Twitter and let's see if I can tweet some developers. I mean, the more support I get from you guys on that, then I guess the more the developers might notice me, you know, so if I say to Wildcard, look, you know, put an end to Scorched Earth by the time my video's out this summer, <laughs> you know, maybe they'll listen. Maybe if, maybe if you get on, get on my board, I mean, we could, we could do that. We should do that, you know, share this video with them. <laughs> Tell them we want an end to Scorched Earth. It is a great shame that there is no overseer or nobody running that particular arc, so there is no ascension off it. I'd say that the way to go about it is to fight the Manticore on Alpha, the same as we did previously. Then after that, we would do an ascension and move on to Aberration. So that's kind of how I'm thinking about doing it. And that brings me on to the PayPal button that I've just put on. Now, a few of you on the Discord have expressed an interest in being able to help out with the channel and contribute towards the server. You're more than welcome to use the PayPal button now. I really appreciate the help. I want to make it clear though, it's, it's not necessary. You don't, you don't have to. I don't want to lock anyone out of any sort of content behind a paywall. I'm just grateful for the views and the comments because that's what means the most to me. I've been streaming on Twitch for about two years and the month of April was the first time I've ever unlocked a payment in Twitch. I mean, you know, this month you, you guys have really, really been kind and because of that I've been able to make a couple of upgrades to the channel. I've invested in some new lights to go on the desk so it's going to improve my camera. I've also got a light at the back of the room as well to you know give another light at the back so i'm hoping that i've got the lighting roundabout right i've also got a stream deck coming as well which is a, a really really cool tool that i'm going to be using for editing and to be able to make my streams that little bit more professional and it's because of your guys subscriptions and bits that i'm able to do that so i'm eternally grateful to all of you that have done that any donations that come in through the month of may i will be putting in the june update so if there's any questions you want to ask or anything you want to tell me or what you want me to put it towards then just put it in the little note on the paypal button 
some of the stuff that we're going to be doing throughout the month of May is I'll be finishing Subnautica. There's one guide that I want to do on that and I'd like to take a little bit of time to make that one. There is already some good guides out on Subnautica but I would like to do my own version of it to accompany the channel. Just the one, just the one video that's a beginner's guide and help um, people get into this game who are just discovering it for the first time. I think that so that's one of the videos that I want to get done in May. I know a lot of you are asking me for a review on the single player settings and I'm going to do that with the first Scorched Earth video. I'm going to do a separate video with all of the settings that we're going to be using for Scorched Earth. I need to refresh my memory of the Scorched Earth map and I want to be able to condense the single player settings video that I did again that was only the second or third video I've done but it is very popular and it is about 35 minutes long I want to be able to condense it down and give you my settings that I'm going to be running through Scorched Earth just as I've done this video there's been a three and a half gig download for Subnautica Below Zero again that's a game that I'm playing in my spare time and maybe in a year or so it'll feature on the channel but I might play a little bit of that on Twitch just to check out what's going on new with it but I can't play it on the channel until it's a complete game yes you might find me doing all sorts of stuff on there but mainly playing on the community server I think that's what you're gonna see but until next time I'm James from complete games and I'll see you <laughs> you actually killed him. <laughs> oh dear.